the hospitality industry lost about $3 million during the first week of the widely publicized and historic floods in the Northland. Many tourists continue to cancel plans and look for alternative vacation spots. When I um, was talking at work about that we were going up, people were shocked that, that we are still going. They thought, why are you going? It's you know, a lot of damage. It's those kinds of questions park officials keep hearing over and over. Are you open? Do you have camping? Should we still come? Uh, we have a reservation. What should we do? Um, how do we get there? You know, which roads are open and uh, can we get there from uh, the Twin Cities? The new integrative social media campaign aims to change that perception. Its core message, Duluth is open for visitors and is a safe place to visit. There's still uh, lingering perceptions that the Canal Park is underwater or maybe the town slipped into Lake Superior. Uh, there was no doubt damage to pockets of residential areas, uh, very substantial damage. But uh, the fact of the matter is the core visitor experience is, is completely unchanged. We didn't really see anything on our way up other than maybe a little road construction. Yeah. That I haven't seen debris or anything and there's a lot of people yeah. out. The message, Duluth is open for you, will be broadcast on TV commercials and on social media networks including Facebook, Twitter and YouTube. The ads will be centered on visual images of Duluth and will run for two weeks. And usually if people get that far, they come up the shore. So, yeah, I think it would be good for us, too. Mm -hmm. And all the way up the shore. In Duluth, Jennifer Walsh, the Northlands News Center.